Alrighty everyone, I figured today was a good day to try and fire up this plasma cutter and see if it works and how well it works. Uh, last night I went ahead and uh, wired on a new plug end that will fit that 50 amp plug in style over there. So I could give it a, a quick test and and see what what it'll do. Uh, so I got the the air hooked up and ran over there to my little air compressor. Um, not the greatest air compressor in the world, but it'll it'll do the trick for testing this out. Um, so pretty much, yep. That's all I did was hook up the power cord there and then. Uh, under the panel here, switch it from uh, the 440 slash 408 voltage uh, hook up to the uh, 208 slash 230 voltage hook up underneath the hood there. So I'll go ahead and see if she turns on. power on, cooling fan running. Uh, here, where's my gun at? I turn it on to set. Definitely blowing gas out of there. The gas light came on. Squeeze the trigger. Gas also comes on, so those are all good signs. I'm gonna go ahead and get set up with some just some steel sheet metal and see if it'll cut. Alrighty, so I've got my ground clamp attached and uh, got my gun here. So just gonna see if it'll snap off this corner. Should sever up to three quarters, so we'll see what it does to this. Well, 
pretty. So as you can see, it actually gives a pretty nice clean cut. Um, you know, it, not the straightest cut, which is operator error, but um, you know, not a lot of you know slag or oxide buildup. Um, just a little bit on the back, but you know, cleaning up that's not going to be you know anything to call home about so um, you know as I get a little bit more in touch with how this thing operates and the feel for it and getting the settings tuned in right uh, I'm sure I can get even cleaner cutting than what I am getting right now but um, you know for the moment seems like uh, everything works really well and looks like another great buy Thanks for watching.